Hey Psych2Goers, welcome back to another video. Today, we'll be talking about some uncomfortable pieces of advice that may resonate. Here are some uncomfortable truths about life that can make you stronger. Number five, someone is always ahead of you. Have you ever been jealous of someone's good looks? Have you imagined yourself in another person's body? Do you wish you possessed someone's talent or fame? There will always be someone better than you and it's time to accept that. Just as how you may get jealous of others, other people may also get jealous of you. You're probably the reason they get insecure, anxious, and upset thinking, why don't I have their life? Jealousy creates a negative chain of reactions. So instead of focusing energy on other people, try channeling it into yourself. Rather than thinking of ways to be like someone or be better than them, try thinking, how can I become a better version of the current me? Frankly, you really have no other choice but to own your life. So might as well make the most of it. You have so much untapped potential and it's either you haven't realized it yet or are choosing not to do anything about it. Number six, if you're second guessing a relationship, you probably shouldn't be in it. Are you in a relationship where you're constantly on the lookout for a better possible partner? Do you regularly ask yourself if you went in it with the right mindset? Do you feel like you're with someone who doesn't fit your standards? If you spend a lot of time second guessing a relationship, it probably isn't a good idea to be in it. Before committing to something or someone, try looking at it from every angle. What do you feel for this person? What type of relationship are you going for? Are you willing to compromise with them? Are you ready for a long-term commitment? It's through answering questions like these that you begin to understand the extent of what you feel. You begin doubting relationships if it's not meeting your needs. So take your time, don't rush, and most of all, don't lower your standards. Number seven, you can't save everyone. Even Superman can't. Do you immediately rush to someone who seems to need help? Do you feel other people's struggles as if they're your own? Have you ever done your best to help someone and ended up being hurt or disappointed? No matter how much you try to help someone or change them for the better, they won't do it or receive the help unless they want to. This may be difficult on your part, especially if you're an empath or if you care a lot for that person. There's only so much that you can offer. The rest of it is beyond your hands. It's not bad to be a helpful person, but it helps to understand that it doesn't always turn out for the better. Some people may lash out at you and others may not appreciate your efforts at all. So if it's doing you more harm than good in the long run, it may be time to cut off those people. Number eight, put money first. Have you ever faced a pressing financial problem? Do you know severely money-driven people? Have you ever wished you had a lot of money to buy all the things you want? Money makes the world go round. It's the reason behind a lot of problems, yet somehow it's also the solution for almost all of them. Money is a necessity. That's why it needs to be a priority. It's easy to say you don't care about money, but a lot of times it's just because you have it. It's why you shouldn't take it for granted and why you should take advantage of the time and resources you have to make it. Be smart, budget properly, and find ways to earn money through your skills. Money can do a lot of things, so it's important to acknowledge its worth and avoid being greedy. Balance is key. Number nine, betrayals will happen. Have you ever been betrayed by someone you trusted? Do you have friends who suddenly changed overnight? Did a loved one do something to make you second guess their intentions? Betrayals happen and they happen quickly. Sometimes even the person you trust the most won't be by your side the next day. <laughs> it can be really painful, especially when you have no clue why they did it in the first place. There are a lot of factors why someone would choose to betray the people they know. They could have been careless, jealous, greedy, or something else. So it's good to be aware of these things because you'll never know when it happens. Try not to trust someone too quickly and be careful who you let into your circle. And number 10, duration doesn't dictate a relationship state. Are you staying in a long-term relationship for nothing other than convenience? Do you feel like you've invested too much into someone to just let go? It's true that the longer you spend with someone, the harder it is to let go but it's not advised to stay in a relationship that's burning you out day by day. You may think that you can salvage what you have, that through staying and enduring, you can make things better. Instead, what likely happens is that you'll drain your energy, 
dedicate unwanted time, and be upset when reminded of bad things that happened in the past. When a relationship feels more like a burden, it's probably time to go on separate ways. It's certainly not easy, but you have to ask yourself, are you a better person with or without them? Share your thoughts. Does this article resonate with you? Which points hit the most? If given the chance, what uncomfortable advice would you give to another person? We're interested in your thoughts, so please don't hesitate to comment them down below. As you may very well know, life is mysterious and unpredictable, and we're all finding ways to make meaning out of it to make life easier. Yet, despite the countless stories, opinions, and bits of advice, the same patterns repeat themselves over and over again. So here's one final bonus piece of advice. Live. Sometimes when you try to learn too much, you forget to actually apply it. And the best way to learn in life is by going out there, making mistakes, and doing what makes you happy. Be a dreamer. <laughs>